you guys, Captain Alex Mason here, and we're going for mission 12. This is the last mission. Now, remember when I said mission 10? I said S Sergeant Reed was on board the helicopter. No, that was wrong. Because the wiki messed up on it again, so. I don't know. Okay, so we're escorting Sergeant Reed. We have to get this nuke device away from the terrorists. I call this Desert Storm. Alright, so this is a new character, Private A. Kirch. Just like every time, I spawn with the same weapons. But I want my Kalashnikov. However, I will admit this Uzi or whatever it was I was using previously was pretty handy. Come on. Wow. What? Bitch, you ain't getting close. Thanks, Acreage. Or Acreage. I don't really know how to pronounce your name. Grenade. No. Oh, okay, you beat me to it. Barraquay. Oh, I was supposed to go that way. Hello, Alternationalist Dirt Bags. Goodbye, Alternationalist Dirt Bags. Oh, I see it. I will admit, Private A. Kirch is actually helping out a lot. Crap. This 
que See no goddamn sniper. What? What? What did I do? What did I do? Where the hell was the fucking sniper? Well, that's retarded. Yeah, where? Can you be a little more specific? Tell me where the bastard is. Cause you know what? I don't see him. Where? It's not made clear where he's firing from. You can't just say sniper and expect me to know where. If you know where the sniper is, tell us where. Don't just be all cryptic and say, Oh, there's a sniper in the area. I'm communicating. Good God, man. It was fucking Chinese New Year or something? Come on. I don't even know where the damn thing is. Like, seriously, he can't expect me to know where the hell this guy is. Because I honestly don't. Where? You cannot just say sniper and not say where. You know what? I'm gonna look it up. Because you know what? At least in the wiki, the people are more supportive than you. I actually regret saying everything about you, saying you were really helpful because you weren't. My god. What a fucking retard. Uh, God damn it. So now I have to look through this stupid walkthrough because, you know, at least the walkthrough is more descriptive than you, you stupid marine. Jesus. I can't believe you're so stupid, eh, Kirch? This is why I'm glad that once I finish with frickin' zombies, this will be the last DS game I ever have to buy that's Call of Duty related. I am never going to play another DS game for as long as I live, if it's first person shooter. So honestly, what I just got was frickin' ridiculous. I don't even want to look at myself after seeing something like that. That was crap. Like, that was a huge load of crap.
You can probably hear some of it because I need to actually hear it because sometimes it'll give you hints. But still, what the hell? I shouldn't have to find a walkthrough to find out where the sh goddamn sniper is, but because Private Akerch isn't being very descriptive as to where he saw the sniper, and he did see it because he says there's a sniper in the area, and then when I get one-shotted by the stupid-ass sniper, he says, SNIPER! just before I die. So he knew where it was, but again, the game's being a douche. Won't tell me where the goddamn sniper is. So that's why I don't trust this damn asshole. I'm sorry. If I sound like a big cuss bug, it's because I don't like this game. You know, at least mobilized was fair. This game is bullshit. I have never had so much bullshit from this game compared to the other two Call of Duty DS games I played. And that's pretty sad. How did he... What? Wait a minute. No. No, 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 no. I'm confused. So... Well, that doesn't make any sense. If he got past that, why did... why couldn't I? So am I here. I want to know what. Hang on. I'm going to try it myself. And if I end up getting another mission failed crap because of him, I am going to be fucking pissed. No. No shit, Sherlock. Why don't you tell me where he is? My God. You say it. You said it again. There's a sniper in the area, but I'm gonna be a dick because I don't want you to live, be a war hero, and get promoted to sergeant. Ass bag. Okay, that's where he was. Again, very descriptive as to where the lo of the whereabouts as to where the location of the sniper was, you douche. He did? Yep. He's gone. Aim down your fucking sights, douche! I have an extreme hatred for this guy because he just gets in my damn way.
Again, you were so helpful, Encourage. I had to get court martialed after this. Fuck. No. Where? Where? Where, god damn it? Akrich. I'm just gonna call you Akrich. No. Shit! What the fuck? You need to get out of the- No! No, you didn't! You fucking piece of shit! I've gotta do this whole crap again? What the fuck? And this is why I don't play this game anymore, because you know what? These checkpoints suck so much balls. I don't even give a damn. First off, they don't spawn me back with the weapons I had originally before I died, or before the checkpoint goddamn failed. So that's always the issue. Second, you know, my character sucks big ass bag balls when it comes to taking cover he doesn't want to half the time I was like fine you know what and the mission solely relies on him to live shit you got real close real soon Okay, I swear to God, Akerch, Akerch, I, I haven't even. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not even gonna try.
Thought you could pull fast for me this time, not today, bitch. Oh, you ass bag. No. God damn it! Wait until it's clear! Now I gotta do it again for you because you're a dumbass! No wonder you're a private. Oh my god, I gotta do everything for you. Are you handicapped? If so, why are you even in the Marine Corps? God damn it, you fucking piece of shit. Stay fucking down. Because I'm sick and tired of being your goddamn babysitter. God damn it, you idiot. Oh my god. Yay. You're not supposed to be alive still. I'm not trying to get angry, but this game sucks when giving checkpoints. That's why I'm trying so hard right now. Not get not to lose my shit here.
What the f- <laughs> Oh my god! You suck motherfucking balls! God damn it! Get the fuck out of my way. You know what? Why are you even here, Akerch? If you can't even prove your worth, you should not even be in this war. You are the worst soldier I have ever known. And that is not debatable. You are the worst piece of shit I've ever known. Sorry, but you know what? This should not be a freaking. This may be the last mission, but it shouldn't be downright damn stupid like it is. Okay? I usually like to play Call of Duty games because they're fun. This is not fun. This is shit. Great, well, n why don't you back the fuck up and let me do my damn job? I may not be your sergeant, but I am your corporal. And I outrank you, so get the fuck back. Because you are causing shit for me that I don't want. And this is easy mode take, ladies and gentlemen. Yet, for some reason, I can't pass goddamn easy mode. No, I never said stop aiming down your sights, now you let the bastard get away. Get down! You fucking, ex you sorry excuse of a soldier. I think I I really pit pity your fucking commander because your commander must have to deal with a lot of fucking incidents with this piece of shit soldier. How did you even pass basic training if you don't even know how to protect yourself from a goddamn grenade? It's not fucking rocket science. Someone here knows how to fucking shoot. Now, if you will excuse me, I'm trying to fucking finish my job. Take him out, you piece of shit.
Okay. I'm not letting this piece of sh shit ruin my night. I'm gonna get this ass. But first... Concussion grenade. God damn it, Kirch. What did I just tell you about breaking cover? God damn it, you're gonna get yourself killed! Oh my god, really? Please tell me. That's all of them. Holy fucking shit. Yes! Fuck yes! Sayonara, bitch! Well, keep her damn steady! Actually, this is a truck, not a Jeep. Thank fucking Christ. You can definitely tell that the bridge that I'm s we're on is supposed to collapse. Oh, come on! You're gonna do you're gonna dick with me like this. Fine. Fuck you. Uh, can I take cover now? Okay. Protect Sergeant Reed and the suitcase nuke. Retrieve the detonator. So we gotta hold out till the time runs out. Which isn't gonna be easy. It's possible that this is a direct remake to uh, the last mission game over. Get back, bitch.
Kovac. Twelve seconds. Oh my God. God damn Christ. What took you so damn long? Hey, help us. Now, even though they say, oh, well, he died, I'm just going to pretend, because I, this originally, like, again, I said this game originally takes place in the year 2011, just like the original. Fuck. That's not what I wanted. But, because the way it, that it works out I wanna say he faked his death now this game I hated this game and I am fucking glad I am done because you know what it should have not taken me 38 fucking minutes to pass this mission you can see how frustrated I am with this bullshit Like, there's no way that this game's supposed to be this goddamn hard. It was. And that's why I don't like it. And unfortunately, the other reason why I hate this game the most, out of all the DS Call of Duty games that I have played, is that this one is the only one with a player determined on it. Not only does that make my job harder, because I don't know how to... F I still don't really know how to play this professionally. I can't, I'm not good. I can't even pass round one on the simplest zombie map in Black Ops DS. Ugh. Fortunately for me, though, the player determined for this game and the zombies and characters for Black Ops DS are the only things really left to do on and of all three Black Ops or of all three Call of Duty DS games and I'm glad because once I get this done I will never have to play them again but that doesn't mean I will sell them because I'm a Call of Duty person to the end and I like to collect Ugh. still oh my god I was, this is supposed to be like maybe a 15 minute mission. It, it took me 38 minutes plus credits, which means you're probably looking at another 3 minutes. I don't like to get this mad, but you know what? 
for a game that's supposed to be entertaining, it is really difficult. So I have to go over all the player determined for this game now. That's going to be fun. And you know what? When this is done, I am going to bed. And speaking of Call of Duty, the only thing left from stopping me from f finishing up Call of Duty for Modern Warfare is one last and final episode for multiplayer on the map Pipeline. Nolan North. Nolan North? Really? He was in this game? You guys don't who know who uh, Nolan North is. He's the voice actor for Edward Richtofen from Zombies. He played... He played a role in this game? Wow. All right, well, it's done. Okay. Usually I give you my thoughts on the game, my game during the credits, but because I had to hold those credits up, I'm going to give you it to it now. Like I said before, but now I'm going to full blow and say it. This game out of all three games and possibly and I know there's a fourth one but I'm not going to play it because it's not it's not worth anything compared to the three that I have it is by this by far is their worst game they ever created the developer end space now end space currently doesn't exist anymore which I'm glad because you know what they couldn't get the concept right in the first place now, with later titles such as Modern Warfare Mobilized and Black Ops DS, they did a better job. Because, you know what, they actually tried. This? I don't think so. This was a load of crap. This, this game. This game right here? Crap. But the other ones? Um... But... These ones here, these ones were not as bad, because you know what? You could at least play them. They were a lot easier to play. Yes, I'm even talking about, I'm even talking 
about this game. Excluding the zombies, which I'll have to get back on soon. This game is all set and done. I don't need to play it anymore. No Easter egg. Ah. Easter eggs. That's another thing I gotta do. And I'm pretty sure Call of Duty 4 has one, because there's a snowman Easter egg and it's ongoing in pretty much most Call of Duty games I've played. Matter of fact, let me search it up now. But I don't want to go through this ever again, because you know what? This is the longest mission video, plus credits, I have ever done. Like I said before, I apologize that I've been so frustrated with this game. Like and uh, like I said so many times before, this was not my favorite DS Call of Duty of all the three games that I will ever play for it. I had. Okay, well, there is, unfortunately, the hidden snow. I can't obtain this Easter egg because the online doesn't work, which is another issue I have with DS games. What if I don't want to play online? It, it doesn't work. It doesn't play. Because freaking Nintendo thought, Oh, well, nobody plays this game anymore, even though we see that this is the most popular handheld console in the freaking world. We're just going to cancel it using an online period. Yeah, good good job, Nintendo. That's another reason why I switched to the PlayStation. You guys completely ignore everything, but then again, who doesn't? It's an ongoing thing. I will tell you if you guys know how to get it. Like, if you guys have the game yourself, I'm going to tell you how to do it. Especially if you guys found a loophole, which I doubt anybody has. Okay, come on. Come on. Thank you. So yeah, it was featured in World of War DS, but like I said before, I am not playing that game. That game sucks. Okay, come on! It's not... It's on the multiplayer map, the Russian, and the snowman is hidden behind two trees, and you have to crouch to see it. Again in the multiplayer map, not the campaign, unless, again, the freaking wiki messed up like they always do in this game because it's not that popular, which I can see why. I don't know. So yeah, I'm Captain Alex Mason, and I will see you hopefully in a better mood next time.